the finals have launched already. One of the best shooters in years and an insanely fun game to play. The game uses the Unreal Engine 5 technologies with destructible environments. Embark Studios behind this game was a former Battlefield developers, who now are an independent studio. The finals is one of the finest FPS out there. That is free to play. The former Battlefield devs have nailed the game objective and gameplay aspects. The character fluid movements, with destructible environments. This game is not going to replace other competitive battle royal games such as Battlefield, PUBG, Valorant, CSGO 2, or Apex Legends in any means. As a casual mobile gamer myself, as I don't have any high-end gaming PCs or gaming laptops. From my technical standpoint, I personally will say it's more fun than all of the other competitive games that I played on my. I watched other streamers play this game and having lots of fun with their friends. And even watching them having fun with their friends makes me want to buy myself a gaming PC. But, it's not possible until I become a big streamer myself, anyway. If you enjoy the video and new here, leave a like and subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon for cool contents. Or, anyone want to support the channel directly, send me super chat or buy me a coffee. Links will be in the description box below the like button. Now, back to the video topic. So, the game it's been out for weeks. Better than the most iconic competitive shooter of all time. The game has some fair criticisms for some of the issues, having perform and issues. And you can't just pretend they don't exist because the game is fairly new. This is not a battle royal where 100 players last standing team wins. There are some balancing to do with the guns, but it's not game breaking meta or anything to go by. Especially the stun gun range is absolutely ridiculously right now in the game. What you can take for granted is that these devs know how to balance their games better than most of the other major game development studios right now. The finals is a PvP game and just like every other title in the category, it features multiple game modes. The finals has a total of three game modes which are Quick Cash, Bank It, Ranked, and Unranked Tournament. Quick Cash is a casual game mode where all four teams will fight for one vault at a time. In this, your objective is to collect to vaults and extract them before the enemy team takes back what they lost. You will respawn pretty quickly in this mode. Next, the bank game mode. This is a 4 team of 12 player game mode where your objective is to extract the maximum amount of cash within a 15 minute timer. Last, but not least, everyone knows about ranked and unranked matches already. There is no point explaining it here. So, moving on. The game have 3 classes to choose from light, medium, and heavy class. Each class has three abilities. Lots of weapons to choose from and tons gadgets for to equip in the game. The light class is very agile, offers fast movement through the map. Now, as light as feather, you can choose between 8 different weapons and 11 gadgets at your disposal. As for the weapons, you can choose, suppressed pistol, SMG revolver, sniper rifle, a samurai sword, and only 3 gadgets you can equip at a time. And, also, the light build have three standard abilities which are a cloak ability. This ability will temporarily make you invisible. That makes you hard to see when moving around the map and total invisible when motionless. Next, the evasive dash ability. You can close distance between you and with the other team you're fighting or dodge incoming bullets. With this ability, although you nod Neo Anderson in the Matrix movie to dodge all the bullets coming at you. Next, the grappling hook. Nowadays every game have a grappling hook feature implemented in them. This is a rope with a hook you can launch to scale structures and swing past walls. Also handy for a quick escape in and out of the combat. Next, we have the medium class. Now, as a medium class, this class is an I will choose. He's the best one to pick, because he has better armor and health than the light class. Not only that for being good healing support and detect nearby enemies and deal more damage. Capabilities as a medium class, who looks ripped ribs and well-maintained physics, you can choose 6 different weapons and 15 gadgets, although, only 3 gadgets can equipable at a time. Now, coming to weapons, you can choose, assault rifle, battle rifle, grenade launcher, action shotgun at your disposal. This class also, have 3 different abilities, which are, first, the healing laser beam. This laser beam can heal your teammates while also providing support for the team if used, utilized properly. The second your teammate health decrease midway battle, while you can still be able heal them and get in the fight swapping between to your other weapons, helping your teammates to catch some breath. Next is, the recon vision. 
This ability trace nearby enemies through walls, showing where they are exactly on the building. And also, the recon vision ability will decrease if the enemy moves further away from you. And the last ability, the dome shield. You can place this blob of bubble shield on the ground. This shield will protect you and your teammates from incoming projectiles. And your teammates can shoot through the shield for 20 seconds or if the shield is destroyed. 